What's up guys? Welcome to uh, another day in France. I am currently in Bordeaux. I got here a few days ago from La Rochelle, which is about two hours away from here. And uh, today guys, as usual, I would like to share with you my first impression of Bordeaux. I first came here back in uh, 2019 for the first time and the second time was in 2021st so uh, it feels good to uh, come back here I am uh, loving this place to be honest and yes you know without wasting any more time welcome to a brand new day in Bordeaux so uh, as usual, I am now heading toward my uh, exhibition. This is what I am going to do for the afternoon. And uh, yes, many people are asking me how I am making money on my journey. So well, I am also an artist. So uh, basically, I am having an exhibition about my journey. And everywhere I go, I make sure to uh, display my uh, exhibition, talk to the people about my uh, project because uh, I am also producing a documentary about my 10 years journey around the world. Basically, this is how I am making it work, you know. So, today it is Thursday and uh, like you can see, people are uh, chilling. It is a hot day today. So this is why there is no many people outside. But uh, guys, I would like to uh, show you the main street here in Bordeaux. They have a huge uh, shopping street and apparently it is the biggest uh, shopping street in Europe. You will see what I'm talking about. Please let me know in the comment section which place you would like to see in Bordeaux and I will be glad to uh, take you around so this is once again the architecture here in uh, Bordeaux pretty much like uh, Paris in somehow you know so let's cross it so I am looking really forward to uh, take you to the south of France I think in about uh, two weeks I will be heading there and uh, I would like to uh, show you Marseille which is the second largest city here in France you will see it is a different world you know in somehow many people are saying that Marseille look like the north part of Africa because there is a lot of people coming from Morocco and also Algeria. So, uh, you know, I am also uh, loving Marseille, even though it is one of the most uh, violent city here in France. But when you stick to the main road, you know, it's not a problem. So, guys, welcome to Bordeaux. So, uh, we made it. On my right, we got the main uh, shopping streets of uh, the city. And uh, I cannot believe my eyes, but it is packed every single day, you know. There is always a lot of people. Look at that. So I think on my left, it is like the dodgy part, kind of, of... Uh, Saint Catherine so this street is called Saint Catherine and uh, yes this is like let's say the fancy part and uh, right behind me it is a little bit uh, the dodgy part of the, the street you know you can see a lot of people uh, well you know what I think I'm going to take you there so you are also going to see what I'm talking about uh, on that side of the street 
you can uh, see a lot of uh, homeless people and you know people sometimes uh, drinking alcohol but uh, during the day it's uh, all good I will say at night it's uh, a different story okay green light I can cross and uh, guys look at Starbucks you know so uh, yeah, people are smashed, unfortunately. So, yes, guys, what a day to be alive. I give it thanks. Like I said, wow, I should definitely go on that side. So, this is a second hand shop where you can find some cheap clothes, you know, for maybe like 10 euros, if I'm not wrong, you know. I think so. So, yeah, this is like, damn, it smells like shit, you know, but this is the dodgy part of uh, the Rue Saint Catherine. Obviously, I am going to uh, record more, you know, I think after my exhibition, I will be done around like maybe. Uh, Eight at night so uh, I am also going to take you at night so you could see the difference okay so yeah on this side of the street you can uh, see a lot of uh, cheap uh, shop where people are uh, selling some uh, clothes you know and to be honest it's not so cheap sometimes you know it depends. I am loving you know coming here because the place is uh, pretty relaxed compared to uh, Paris and uh, I think in the city there is approximately 250,000 people living here and in all the agglomeration I will say about 800,000 so uh, it's not a big city you know it's not even one million people living here so yeah this is uh, street food in france you know some cables and all this kind of stuff we are moving further all right like i said you can find a lot of uh, shop and you know this is like 25 euros or 10 euros you know not too bad if you want to buy some clothes Waters. You can uh, get a haircut here. But yeah, at night, guys, it is uh, more alive, you know. There is more people and also there is a lot of bars, you know. So people are just uh, chilling. And, uh, you know, here in France, people love doing that. I am sometimes wondering how, you know, but... So we made it to the end of the street. Well, it's not too bad. On my left, there is a McDonald's. And uh, you know, people are selling some uh, flags. You can see also many people coming from uh, Africa, you know, just uh, doing a delivery. And yes, so to be honest, this is not a great spot to uh, set up an exhibition because uh, like you can see it's uh, pretty quiet so there is not many people here so it's better for me to go all the way down the street wow it's very very crowded you know so this is uh, Bordeaux on a Thursday afternoon guys and today it is a very hot day as uh, usual uh, summer is almost coming to an end i think in less than uh, two weeks people are going to uh, get back to their uh, jobs you know and uh, yeah also i think uh, maybe tomorrow i am going to uh, take you to different area of bordeaux because uh, you know there is like some diversity you can see a lot of people coming from the caribbean 
and also a lot of people coming from the north part of Africa. So, yes, guys, please hit me up in the comment section which place you would love to see here in uh, Bordeaux. To be honest, this is not really my type of video because of myself, I love uh, moving by hitchhiking and also, uh, as you, you have noticed, I love sleeping like everywhere, but you know, I try to uh, adapt and uh, give you a different type of um, content, you know? So this is more like uh, city content where I am uh, in the city and just like uh, showing you the daily life of the people here in uh, Bordeaux. But what I love the most, obviously, is to uh, each a ride, uh, sleep anywhere, and uh, just keep on moving, you know? I don't really like uh, staying too long in one city. Anyway, guys. Oh, so this is also a Chinese restaurant, and I think it's uh, not too expensive, you know? So, you know, you can find a different type of food here, you know? Yeah, also Japanese restaurant, you know? And this is like a kebab, you know? It's not uh, too expensive, I think for about for eight or nine euros, you can get uh, a sandwich. But I'm fed up, you know? I am tired of uh, eating it. So uh, yes, sometimes it's good to change. Bonjour, bonjour. All right, guys. Still, you can find some cheap clothes, you know. So this is the biggest shopping street in Europe. But um, you will see at night, it is a different world. I am trying to hide because uh, there is a lot of sun, you know. It's a very sunny day. I remember like a few years ago, I came here to fix my dreadlocks and someone like messed me up, guys. So I had to shave, you know, such a pity. So this is like some Lebanese food, you know. Here, like the good points, you can find different uh, type of dish, you know. Five euros, you know. Pretty cheap here. And also here, I won't lie, there is a lot of girls, you know. <laughs> so you can see a lot of girls from all around the world. You got some uh, choice here, you know. And there is also a lot of uh, people coming from Spain and also Ireland or England, you know. So this city is quite uh, touristic. I think it is now almost 2 uh, p.m. I hope you know the video will be good, you know, because I am not really sure how it looks with the sun, you know. But uh, yeah, on that side, it is much better. So, well, let's keep on moving. This is my, uh, you know, kind of my first impression of uh, Bordeaux. People are having a coffee, just uh, chilling. On my right, there is a nice restaurant, you know, or also I think coffee. Okay, so on that side, it is like uh, more organized, you know. You can uh, still find the same uh, type of uh, shop. Still people are selling some clothes here. 
you can find some uh, kebabs you know in every big cities in france you can see a lot of diversity so you can find a lot of uh, people coming from different places especially the north part of africa and uh, also the sub-saharan part of africa and uh, wait until i uh, take you to uh, marseille you will see it is such a different world you know guys i swear i want to take a move so bad you know i just want to uh, go to different uh, countries you know like uh, switzerland or italy but uh, still i am going to uh, stay in france for like maybe uh, a couple of weeks even though i am not feeling the most comfortable here because uh, you know once again i feel that i don't uh, fit into the mindset you know i am uh, thinking uh, differently and here mainly people love to uh, stay in the box you know so people don't take risk people don't dare to dream big unfortunately so myself i don't really find myself here into this type of uh, society and uh, yes so i may go back to the us maybe in the next uh, few months for sure because here i feel that you know in terms of like mindsets or uh, just you know doing something different this is not the best place unfortunately Damn, guys this place so all right this is the uh, usest part of uh, the street of saint catherine like you can see today it is like a hot day i am trying to find the shade anyway guys i hope you did enjoy the video please subscribe to my youtube channel give it a like a comment you know and uh, yes let's reach 10k guys you know we are almost there so yeah i think i won't be able to uh, set up my exhibition right now i am maybe going to wait for like half an hour and then i will be good to go but uh, yeah so this is the biggest shopping street in europe uh, maybe tomorrow i am going to uh, take you to a different location and uh, see who we are going to meet i am also staying at my front place so uh, later on i am also going to uh, introduce you to uh, thomas guys finally i made it so this is the end of the street here I am thirsty. I should get some water. And this is like Apple Store here. All right. Okay, guys, that's it. I made it to the end of the street of Saint Catherine. So that was the biggest shopping street in uh, in Europe. All right. what a beautiful day you know i am uh, going to sit down for a while find myself something to drink and that's it all right guys peace